What's up everybody, Billy from Typical Reviews here, and today we're going to be looking at the Swagway, Mono Rover, Hoverboard, or whatever those things are called these days. No matter what it's called, you've seen it all over YouTube, Twitter, Vine, Snapchats, and even some celebrities have even brought it onto late night talk shows as well. So what is it? How does it work? And where can you get one of these hot new devices? All these questions and more answered in today's video. First off, what is it? It's a two-wheeled self-balancing scooter. It's kind of like a Segway, but without the grips that you can actually hold on to. Essentially, you're gonna be working this thing with your feet and balance only. Top speed on one of these bad boys is about 15 kilometers per hour or nine miles per hour. Now, they take approximately two hours to fully charge, but with a fully charged battery, you can take it about 20 kilometers, and that's about 12.5 miles, depending on your usage. How does it work? It works by placing your feet on the weight sensitive pads and manipulating it that way. By applying pressure on the right pad, it actually starts to move the board counterclockwise, and if you apply pressure on the left hand side, you're gonna be moving it clockwise. Now, if you wanna go forward, you actually have to apply pressure to both of them in the front, and it'll both actually bring both of the motors to go forward in that way. And same kind of deal if you wanna go back. You apply more pressure in the back, and it'll start moving both the motors at the same time going backwards. To get on one of these, I suggest that you put on your dominant foot forward first, and then quickly apply your other foot afterwards. By doing this, you maintain your balance a lot better. But when you wanna get off the board, make sure that you step backwards from it. Because if you step forward, the board might literally sweep you off of your feet. Now, where can you actually buy one of these? I'm sure you've all heard of the big name players just like Funky Duck and IOHawk, but both of these cost around $1,500 or more. If you wanna pick up the Mono Rover R2, you can find one on Amazon for about $450 with free shipping. But if you're really resourceful and you don't mind waiting at all, you can actually pick one up from sites like Alibaba for around $200 or so. Now, by no stretch of the imagination is this gonna be a primary transportation device, and it's not gonna replace something like, you know, a bicycle, but it is something really fun to ride around in and gets you a lot of attention. People will even come up to you and ask you questions about it because it's such a peculiar device. So if you like attention, you gotta pick yourself up one of these. Also, a quick thing to note and remember is these bad boys will get scuffed up and scratched up pretty badly, especially when you're learning just how to ride it. Believe you me, it's not gonna be something that you're gonna keep in pristine condition. Overall, it's an awesome device and it's a joy to just step onto it and and just ride around freely. If you get a chance to pick one up, I would absolutely do it. It's a fantastic and unique little device, and believe you me, it's gonna be really awesome this holiday season. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to press that like button, and if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to us at Typical Reviews for more videos just like this one. Thank you very much for watching, I hope you have an awesome day, and peace out. And for you guys that stuck around to the end of the video, here's some bonus footage of me, Typical Gamer, and Ecovald all riding around with it in the six. Billy, so what happened there? So it looks like a little group of people over there. They're really curious about this thing. So a lot of people just come up and ask you if you have one of these, you know, how does it work? How much is it? How fast does it go? It's got some balance on it. And you know what? If you like attention, this is definitely a way to get it. Oh yeah, where are we right now? So right now we're actually where the Rogers Center, formerly known as the Sky Dome, where the Blue Jays play. Yeah. And also, we'll see in Pal. Six in the six? Yeah, and we're at gate six in the six. Gate six in the six. Right in the heart of the six. Just kidding, man, it's just a prank. <laughs> <laughs>